we had seen you know, the Project Spark through the Midas program, we thought that certainly there were some opportunities in the Twin Cities to be part of that program. And I thought that would be a neat opportunity to do something for the community. And we found a great young couple. They were both members of the armed forces, him and his wife. I am a field artillery maintenance supervisor. I served as a 91 Papa, so we were a maintenance team attached to artillery. Well, I've been serving for 10 years. I've been in the military for six years. I have a daughter, Ava Marie, she's 10 years old. My four-year-old son, Eli. Scarlett, who's two, and then we just had a baby. And Noah, who's four months old. So we're really busy. Everything is just happening so quickly. So many things to do. <laughs> the hardest part of our family right now is just getting to where we need to go. The sacrifices that the men and women in the military make and, and to find out that when Chris is walking to work and walking home. And... Which is like 10 miles from our house at like four in the morning. It's definitely been very challenging. It's a perfect family car. It's gonna fit their family needs and situations very nicely. When we pulled up and I seen the red bow, I'm like, <gasps> a van. I wanted a van so bad. Chris and Lauren, we'd like to thank you for your service. And on behalf of Midas and 1-800-CHARITY-CARS, we'd like to present you with this vehicle we've repaired for you. Thank you. That's going to be such a tremendous help. Just being able to do all the things that we really wanted to do as a family. Now we can all go to where we need to go and together as a family. It should last them quite a while. It's, we're very proud of the work we did to make it ready. So grateful. I'm really happy that this is true for us. And I think it's a time that we want to make sure they understand what Midas as a whole wants to get back to the community. We're not just fixing cars, but we're giving something back. You know, Midas being the great company that it is, you know, I'm just excited to be here and to be a part of that. He can spend a lot more time at home with his family versus hiking back and forth on the road to work. One of those things where you can never do enough or give enough back to anybody as a whole, but especially our veterans. When we heard that Midas and the United Heroes came together and, and did this, and, and whoever donated the car, like, thank you so much. Honestly, this, this has truly been a blessing. Thank you, Midas.